that don't know, uh, my dad worked right here in Cedar Rapids. Uh, started out down at Farmstead, no college education. Started out at Farmstead in the meat processing industry. Uh, worked there for a few years and, and landed a job up in uh, Independence at Iowa Ham Candy, another meat processing facility. And uh, after 20 years of working in the meat processing industry at the age of 55, no college education, his facility was shut down. His facility was shut down along, and he lost his job like 150 other people lost their job. I'm part of the working class. I'm part of, I've experienced a family member losing their job. I know how tough that is. But I want to tell you what he did. He didn't go sit in a line somewhere with his hand out. He didn't go looking for a government handout. He didn't sit, certainly didn't sit on unemployment for 99 weeks. He landed a job over five hours away in Council Bluffs, Iowa, and ultimately ended up commuting back and forth to pay the bills, to do what he does, to, to work in the industry that he knows how to work in. And I tell you that story because he did something different. That's exactly what we want to do in this campaign. I'm not going to stand up here in front of you and tell you how great your lives are going to be because Ben Lyons elected. You all know better than that. No more pandering. No more looking for votes. No more telling you how great your life is going to be because we have some politician elected. This is about looking people in the eye and understanding that principle has to be put before party. We are facing a catastrophe that if we don't put somebody in office to fix this, it doesn't matter who we have in there. And I'm prepared to do that. I was prepared to do it last time around, and I'm prepared to do it this time. Bottom line is this. You all know how much work this is. You know how, what a commitment this takes to be competitive against a man that is funded by every single trial attorney across this nation. You know the amount of work it's going to take. But here's the good news. We can win this. We can win this race. We have raised more money than any Republican challenger in the state of Iowa. We have put together an organization that is top-notch. Back in the corner back there, if you would please stand up. This is Jay Bronger. Jay. <laughs> Jay Bronger just came on board with us. He ran the entire field operations for Senator Santorum. And I tell you that because we are prepared to do this. The ultimate question is, is we need somebody that can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with Bruce Braley. And there is no doubt about it who that candidate is. I'm asking for your help. I'm asking for your support. And I know you've had candidates stand up here over and over and over again and ask it for you. Look, I'm just a, a small-town guy from Quasweet in Iowa that has never ran for office before. I just got sick and tired and got off my couch and decided to do something about it. And I need your help in Lynn County. And if nothing else you take away from tonight, you know this. Look, there's no boondoggle. There's no skeleton in the closet. There's nothing that you have to worry about. I'm just Ben Lyons with my three daughters and my wife and my parents that walk in a parade. We already did three of them this weekend. And I tell you that because it's important. Because you need to know that you can have the confidence to go home and tell your friends, tell your family, tell your neighbors that this is a campaign that you can believe in. So I'm asking for your help. Please go to LangforCongress.com. And one other thing, 1.9% separated us. Pass, being passed around right now are supporter cards Those, and a sign-up sheet. That's what makes the difference. That's where the rubber meets the road, where we put together a team in Lynn County that is second to none. So please take a moment to fill those out. Please pass them into Jake Ronger here before the end of the night. I'm asking for it. I'm telling you we can do this, and I'm willing to put the work in. So appreciate being here. I'll be glad to stick around, and uh, thanks for having me. Next to Brian Cunningham. Oh, we cancel? Okay. See, this is how it works. You all think I am. I am afraid that I'm throwing my daughters are going all around. Mary's running this damn thing. Just get used to it. Okay. <laughs>